Hi there, I'm Chris Cusack and we have just arrived in Wallet Woods. My wife is behind the camera, Amy. Um, as you can see, the car park is gravel, unfortunately, but they have kindly put this paved area. Um, so anyone that has trouble with gravel, you should be okay. Um, the building is amazing. And if we walk down here, you should be able to see some of the brilliant scenery that will greet you on arrival. Beautiful Hampshire countryside. The journey here was easy, uh, one of Woods staff provided us with all the details that we needed to know how to get here. When you arrive, there is a key safe outside the door, you'll be given a code, and it's just a simple matter to get your key. And enter the building. Well, we've come inside now, it's level entry to get in, and as you can see, it's massive. There's plenty of floor space to move around, and it's absolutely jam-packed with goodies. Um, the kitchen is fully stocked with coffee, tea, there's even beer, which I'm very happy about. Um, If you look over here, there is an electric chair that is one of the um, stand assist chairs, I believe. And it's level access through the patio doors at the back, as well out to where the hot tub is. dog as well, it's dog friendly, it's a nice fenced in area. Right, if we go inside now I'll show you the bedroom and the bathroom. Right, there are three bedrooms, one of which is completely adapted. Um, if we go in here, the doorway is nice and wide, and as you can see, there's plenty of space in here. I can do the uh, the spin test, turn my chair around. Um, we have an ensuite adapted bathroom, which is also um, it has a second door, and everyone can use it. It is an amazingly big wet room bathroom with grab rails, two showers so it can be at different heights, there is plenty of space underneath the sink as well for a wheelchair to get up to it, and the toilet seat is at a very good height for transferring. I believe they have removable grab rails that can be fixed if needed. In the wardrobe here there are low rails as well which is always handy when you're in a chair. Trying to reach up is sometimes a pain. The other bedrooms are quite sizeable and if you don't require a wet room they would be usable by a person in a wheelchair I would, I would say because you have the wet room here just across the lounge. Okay.
Hi, day one in Wallops Wood, and we've decided to come into Winchester, which is actually very close. Um, behind us you can see Winchester Cathedral. Um, they have made every attempt to make it fully accessible. To the left of the front door is a ramped entrance. Uh, even where there's a change in level at the back, they have got a platform lift. It does have a weight limit, so it might be worth checking if you want to go up behind the altar and see. Um, but it is a fascinating place. It holds one of the world's oldest Bibles and beautiful architecture and well worth a visit. It's also worth noting that Winchester has quite a large pedestrianised area, so if you're in a chair, there's no worry about cars once you get to that. There's plenty of disabled parking as well. Well, it's our last morning here, and we are definitely sad to go, but it has the QSAC seal of approval because we're already talking about a return visit maybe later this year. Before we go, though, I wanted to show you guys the non-adaptive bedroom, just so you could see it could, at a push, be used if you've got more than one you know, wheelchair in your party. Um, if you look, the floor space is quite substantial. In fact, I've stayed in adapted hotel rooms with less floor space than this. The drawbacks of this room is the ensuite is not adapted. My beautiful camera woman will show you what the ensuite looks like. Um, you have to bear in mind that you do have the wet room bathroom just across the hallway. So, at a push, it could be used that way. The last thing I wanted to say is, if I was giving any of you a tip for coming here, I'd say talk, talk to the owners when you book. Um, talk to the staff. They're very, very helpful. They have a list of equipment that they can loan you that may allow you to travel a lot lighter than you would normally travel. There's also some equipment that you can hire from them rather than bringing it yourself. Um, they made themselves known to us within an hour of us arriving and you get the impression that they couldn't do enough to help. Anything you need, any problems, there's a phone in the lounge, you just pick it up and talk to them. Um, and I'd just say come and have a good time.